Warhammer Space Marine 2 is an absolute joy to play, taking us back to the good old days of no fluff, just straight up chaotic action. This game doesn't seem to benefit at all from the extra RAM capacity, as both configurations are neck and neck. Along with that, you can tell there's a heavy CPU bottleneck in place, as the performance going from 1080p to 1440p barely changes. At 4K, both configurations are still neck and neck here. Ratchet & Clank Rift Apart is a game that's really well optimized, and this gives us the headroom to utilize ray tracing on high settings without needing to use upscaling or frame generation, so we're playing at native resolution. I thought with ray tracing involved, we might see some more interesting results, but as you guys can see across all three resolutions, there is no advantage of going with 48 gigabytes in this title. Just like with Ratchet & Clank Return is another game that runs really well, and we're able to use ray tracing at native quality settings. However, just like the previous titles, performance across all three resolutions is the same for 32GB versus 48GB. At 4K, both configurations